Hi everyone, welcome to the channel. Today I want to share a quick and simple photo edit in Luminar Neo using AI tools. Recently I was just experimenting with this photo and ended up getting a really fun result. Stick around to the end to see how it turned out. Let's get started. Most of the work was done using Generase, and I think it did a fantastic job removing the elements I wanted gone. So let's give it a try. Here's the first result, it looks great already. Yes, the process takes a bit of time because it's better to remove things gradually for the best outcome. By the way, Luminar Neo also has a regular erase tool and it can automatically remove power lines. Just click remove power lines. No need to select anything manually. Wow, that's fast and neat. Back to Generase. Let's switch to speed mode so you don't get bored watching me click. I'll now remove everything else I don't like. I'm leaving several people in the shot. I want the image to feel more alive. I really like it, especially how some elements weren't just erased, but were smartly replaced with textures that match the surroundings. Results so far, and here's what we've got. Let's try GenSwap now. Let's move on to another AI tool. I wanna replace these windows. Here, I'll need to type in a short description of what I want to see instead. Let's try again. Yes, I like these much better. I'll keep them. By the way, I have another video on how to quickly give your photos an autumn atmosphere using Luminar presets. I'll link it here if you haven't seen it yet. Final adjustments. Now I want to make a few basic edits. Straighten the horizon, adjust exposure and shadows. Try a different sky, but still keep that beautiful blue tone. So many options, maybe this one? They all look good and you can really get creative. I'll stick with this one. I want something simple. I'll finish off with Enhance AI. A touch of vignette. Landscape Enhancer. And this LUT, that's enough for today. What really interested me this time was seeing how well the generative tools handled such a big cleanup task. Not bad at all. A photo that was filled with distractions now looks clean and professional, perfect for a city landing page or even just to enjoy. And now I wanna challenge myself even more. I'll find a photo that's even messier and try editing that too. We're still learning after all. Thanks so much for watching till the end. Let me know what you think in the comments, give it a like, and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already.